Hello guys, this is an update video on the rose bushes that I had planted not too long ago and I wanted to start off with the first bloom of 2024 and it is the black Bacara that has produced the first bloom of this year. Look at this you guys, it is just absolutely beautiful. I mean, I have no words for it. We just had some rain and now the sun just came out so I just thought I would take this opportunity to uh take this video and look at this i mean it is a very quintessential gothic rose for any gothic garden out there and it is just absolutely i mean the the color it reminds me of blood and it's, it's this dark deep red and it is just, I, I can't stop looking at it and I had to share it with you guys. And as you can see, it's looking very healthy and I hope it keeps uh, going. So it's kind of maybe teasing me or giving me a preview of what I expect from this amazing rose bush. And I can't wait to see how, how much bigger it'll get and how much, um, how much more it'll bloom throughout the year. Here's the other black Baccara. This is actually the French Canadian one and it does look healthy as well. It's doing pretty good so far and it, do, it did come with wax on, on some of the stems. So where the wax is, that's where some of the stems are black. So I think I'm going to cut those black stems off and let's see what happens. Hopefully the color will improve, but those black stems are just a few. So I'm just going to clip them off. Um, soon. This one here is the Intrigue Rose. It is a Floribunda versus the ones that I showed you earlier. Those are hybrid teas. This one is not looking as healthy as the Black Baccaras. It's looking all right. It's looking, it's trying. Some of the canes are trying really hard to bud, but they're just not quite there yet. And as you can see, some of the tips are black. So I'm going to clip the tips of, the, of these canes and hopefully It'll do much better. It's not looking bad, but it could look much better, I think. And let's see how, how much better it'll get. And this one here is Audrey Rose. It's the rose that came with the house. It looks like a very ancient rose. I'm not sure how long it's been here. If I only knew how old it was, that would be so cool. But as you can see, it's doing really well. It's the first rose that I have ever pruned and I was so scared initially thinking that I would mess it up or even harm this rose but I did a great job if I do say so myself and uh, it is just looking fabulous and I can't wait to see until it starts blooming again. To finish off this video, I want to show you that this statue has finally died and I saved her head. She was the first statue I ever got. I used to love her. She was one of my favorite. I used to cherish her a lot. But one day, one of the animals knocked her over. She split into two. I was able to glue her back together. She looked fine still, but this time around, she couldn't make it anymore. She got knocked over when I, when I was moving the bigger statue around that I had showed you guys in the other video and I couldn't glue her back together, but I did save her head. And as you can see, she was made out of some sort of plaster uh, material with possibly resin. This used to be what she looked like before she died. And I really do miss her. I think I'm going to look to see if I could find her again. It was really hard to find her online and I chanced upon her, but I haven't seen her really being sold anymore anywhere else. But I'll look, it doesn't hurt to try. So maybe I'll find her again. But if not, she did have a really cool look. She really did fit into my garden. She had this very gothic haunting look. 